music is so good. And welcome to New Interest. We are back here. Not back here. We are here playing the sibling experiment. And it's not some weird sibling brother or sister fetish. It's a new prog rock band. Yeah. The sibling <laughs> this experiment. Is These two look very similar. Also, this chick has got really big eyes. It's like the Devin Townsend project. Yeah. The sibling experiment. <clears throat> right. Um, so, yeah. Uh, apparently, from what I read, it's going to be like they switch siblings like they get a new one kind of like wife swap but like sibling edition i guess from what i gathered or uh, oh my god we're i the thought girl. tj was a guy okay I read so that. did i the description on the page was misleading yeah uh what that uh, is one? tj sassy or is jazz uh jazz is the sassy one i think mm. jazzy she's sassy mm. she's so sassy so it's either what was it? It was either sassy or uh, tomfoolery. I, I can't remember. I think it was something like I, don't know, I can't remember. I say we'd be the sassy bitch. Okay, we'll be Jasmine. Jasmine, Jasvinder. You can do the narration. <laughs> You're better at it. <coughs> Let me warm up for this. Yeah, go for it. <laughs> <laughs> the best mysteries often remain unsolved. I don't have to do a girl voice, but... Yeah. Is this going to be yet another one of them? Probably. I, I, if this is a girl voice, I... I <laughs> that's a very deep voice. Yeah. I hope not. I've always been one to try and find a logical answer for the unexplained. Oh, I know. I want to do William Shatner. <laughs> There's so many commas. But I have to admit that there was something surreal about it. Supernatural, even. You think it was God? Well, if it was his doing, he sure as heck... Taught me a lesson. <laughs> Though if sure anyone heck. ever needed to be taught a lesson, I would be the last person on the list. Or so I thought. <laughs> da, da, da. Can you really blame me? Though. Top-notch school performances. On fleek appearance. Without a hair out of place at any given moment. <laughs> killer sense of fashion. I thought, you, I, I thought you added on fleek. <laughs> <laughs> I looked up and it says on fleek. <laughs> and, yeah... That's about it. I never really reflected upon myself before this took place. This music. So it didn't occur to me that I never had much going on. As far as I cared, I was perfection. And there wasn't much point in perfecting perfection, was there? Wow. Wow, this is a uh, She's very humble, full, humble. Full of herself. What life I had could be considered good, if not for this one giant obstacle that always tested my patience and tainted my reputation as one of the coolest kids in sc at school. Wow. The one and only. <laughs> this noob named Eric. <laughs> noob. <laughs> Get good. If I had the powers to, I would surely have cut him out of my life. And God knew how many times I was in fact scheming on that. Jeez. Dropping him off in the middle of nowhere. Sending him flying across the ocean. Anywhere. I didn't care, as long as I could keep him as far away from my sanitized, highly hygienic belongings as possible. But there was one little thing hindering me from doing that, aside from me not having a driver's license or living anywhere near the beach. We lived under the same roof. Oh. Also, you can abandon him elsewhere than the, 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 the beach. beach. Yeah, <laughs> it's kind of that's kind of a chill way to to try and abandon somebody. It's like, ha ha. <laughs> Enjoy yourself. Oh, okay. <laughs> Touch my spaghetti. <laughs> and oh, oh, I thought you that. And even more, we had the same parents. Well, yes. In other words, he was my brother, the noob. The noob. One month previously. Earlier. What? One month earlier than. Oh, I was like, did I read it? Okay, thought I read it. <laughs> Like you and any other girl out there suffering with a male sibling. Oh, I know, right? I've had my share of annoying brother problems. To name a few, well, breathing around my favorite clothes. How dare he? Mm -hmm. Refusing to drive me places. <laughs> being in a constant state of undress in front of my friends. It's his I house. believe that's a crime. It's his house. Well, if it's just, if it's just shirtless. <laughs> 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 just walks around naked. <laughs> hey, ladies, how's it going? Well, no, he's undre No, he's constantly undressing. So he's like, he's like taking his shirt on, putting it back on, pulling his pants off, putting him back on. Oh, it's so hot in here. Oh, I'm so cold now. <laughs> he's like taking off his shoes, putting them back on. People are like, what is he doing? 
and using my roll on deodorant on his okay now that's too far it's not too far it's weird but don't well, don't use my goddamn deodorant like fuck i don't share that with my siblings i don't either but i wouldn't be like i, I, I would if jeff stole my deodorant and used it I'd be like okay mm. I, I just, just, I just no my armpit it's mine it wasn't like he couldn't get his own he was just that kind of nasty nice. i agree it was nothing short of a miracle that I had survived the past 16 years of life without him. With him. Oh. <laughs> Shh! Am I Eric! <laughs> hey, sis! You left your toenail clippings That's all gross. over the coffee table. You're not even civilized. He sniffed his armpit and looked at me disinterestedly. Just use it, though. I'm plenty civilized. Case in point I have food on that table food <laughs> food and disgusting toenails do not mix I'm sure they do why the hell did you even clip your elephant toenails in the kitchen any why why is it is there a coffee table in the kitchen I don't know um, it looks like a dining table to me yeah but she's talking about being in the kitchen like, and she said didn't she pick a coffee table I don't know yeah uh. Take that to your little D and D cave upstairs. Yeah, it even looks kind of like my brother. <laughs> Say, have you ever tried eating toenails? What? The fact that you actually have the nerve to bring that up. Then how would you know that that they don't mix? Toenails could be a nice sandwich addition. Ooh, berry jam sandwiches, things and toenails, yum. Um, oh. want to try one? I'm doing toenail sandwich right now. These aren't enough. I've, I haven't clipped my fingernails in about three weeks. Should be enough. Hmm? I just stared at him. Hmm? Was he for real? How would one even proceed to go on with this disgusting talk? I hung my head, unsure whether to scream or cry. <laughs> wow. Real choice. Scream. I glared at Eric, readied my breath, and let out an ear-piercing scream. I would do the scream, but there are people sleeping. The pig squeals in those trash. Hey! Trashy metal. He always listens. Oh, I like him more now. <laughs> the pig squeals in those trashy me metal. He those trashy metal? Word. He always listened to got nothing on me at the moment. <laughs> oh, that's not. <laughs> Ow, eardrums. Yeah, stop it. I screamed even louder at his request. Eric ducked for cover, trying to block out the lovely... She's doing a growl? Coming out of my throat with his hands covering his ears. Jesus, stop. You'll damage your vocal cords screaming so improperly. Ha! Sounds like you. I didn't stop for another minute or... Jesus, lungs. <laughs> At this point, that, I needed a glass of water badly. That diaphragm, though. Are you done yet? Not yet. Just wait until my voice recovers. <laughs> You're plain, plain insane. You're plain and disgusting. <laughs> Rude. You're such a drama queen. You're such a butt herded douche. <laughs> that's a, I've never done such a butt herded. That's the first for me. <laughs> butt herded. It's, it's like an adverb mixed with an adjective. <laughs> but it, it, it's. Is it, it, it an adjective? Who cares? Just keep reading. I think butt hurt would have done. You're despicable. You know that. How many times has this happened, huh? Dozens! It's not funny. I hate it, and you know it. You're never funny, so can you just stop? When will you start realizing that? Never. You're literally the worst, and I wish you'd given me a day, just a mere day of peace, without any of your grossness breathing down my neck. But even that would that seem to be too much to <laughs> ask for. That seemed to be... You really just worked up over a few toenails. Fucking toenails! <laughs> over a few toenails. A few toenails. Did you not hear any of the words I just said? Seriously. I... My throat was hurting badly the more I spoke. Any more and I was sure it would it'd bleed. So her eyes got super wide there when she's pissed off. Screw this. How could those emo weirdos scream for hours? They do it properly. Technique. Yeah. I can't deal with you right now. Screw breakfast. 
get your stupid toenails out of my face and don't speak to me for the rest of the week. She is or maybe the rest of his life. Dramatic. I wouldn't have minded. That pothead he just didn't get it. He's got a skull shirt. He's awesome. I said everything straight to his face, and he didn't get a single word to his ears. Did he really have to be that retarded? Whoa. Whoa. Who used the R word? What are you staring at? Piss off. She's a... I managed to avoid him for the rest of the night. I knew this couldn't go on forever. Actually, being a high schooler that I was, I would have to deal with him the next day anyway. Oh, we're in the car now. Oh, shit. Eric drove me to school, as per usual, but had his death metal music. That's not death metal. It's like punk. Does it mean, just because they say death metal, it means they gotta play death metal. Mm. But had his death metal music blasting the entire time, like always. It would be pretty hard to find my uh, uh, royalty-free death metal. Eh. That means there's a mark for it. Let's do it. <laughs> for real, though, what was all this growling, satanic noise he called music? He was such a loser. Same. I feel like she needs to be a, va a, a, a valley girl. It was quite a, ri a quiet ride with him constantly throwing me glances and me casually ignoring him. Yeah, I like that one. <laughs> oh, my God. Pick a voice. <laughs> As we arrived at school, Eric tried to speak to me after a messed up sideways parking attempt, but I didn't even let him get a word out and slammed the passenger do seat door in his face. The passenger seat door? Mm. The thing about Eric was that he did everything wrong, so when he tried to be nice, it would be even worse than if he was purposely out to get me. For instance, he once attempted to shove an apologetic slice of pizza under my door but instead of soothing my damaged soul it just got sauce everywhere but he tried he tried who shoved pizza under a door yeah that was a poor attempt like would you not realize it was going everywhere after like the first second everywhere he's a stoner from the door to my delicate carpet and even more outrageous what did he do like did he shove it under there and flip it he just squished it and it just kept going why was all her shit right next to the door who knows and even more outrageous, all over my new shoes. His middle name should have really been Fail. Eric <laughs> Fail Jameson. It had a, a realistic ring to it. But it wasn't Fail. It was Doug. <laughs> of course it was Doug. And he wasn't a fan of people knowing that. So it had to be our little secret. Or not. Now that I'm telling you all this. With the three L's. <laughs> it's like someone else who doesn't like people knowing his middle name. Anyway. Weird. Anyway. Like I owe him any favors. It's good mocking materials. I'd rather it be Doug than what it is. <laughs> You're named after somebody. Uh-huh. Actually, we're both named Most after Most middle names are named after somebody. We're Both our middle names are after our grandpas. <laughs> and as if the 15-minute ride with him in the morning wasn't insufferable enough, he went to do the unthinkable. He tried to approach me at school. Dun-dun-dun. <gasps> I didn't know why he did it. I honestly didn't care. All I knew was I didn't want him anywhere near me in public. He should have he should have known better than to approach me when I was in front of my friends, of all people. They were the last people on earth whom I'd want to witness my brother's grossness. <laughs> on top of that, I had to dent a good Prada handbag by hitting him until he got the hint to retreat and walk away. What a pain. That's your own fault, though. Just use your hand next time. Uh, Punch him. Whoa, music. If there was one rule at home that I absolutely hated, it was the one regarding family dinners. Is that your mom? Because she... I think so. Yeah, is she like sexy doctor? <laughs> I don't know. Our parents were always busy, so they always made sure that when they did have the time to sit down with us, we all had to gather together no matter what. Did anyone actually want to suffer this dinner together? I sure didn't. Mom and dad were... Why is one... Yeah, I guess. Never mind. Mom and dad were enough to deal with, but Eric took the cake. With that stupid 20-sided dice of... It is my brother. <laughs> well, I guess she said he was playing D&D. &D. Yep. But he doesn't listen to... Well, kind of. Rolling the probability of him being able to take another bite of his meal. <laughs> that, that extra nerdy. I wanted to shove the dice down his throat. The lamer part? The lamer part? 
my parents just sat there and continued on with their meals as if he wasn't an abnormal freak. He's not hurting anybody. Leave him alone. They were usually distracted, though, as they were both chiropractors and had their own practice. You have two parents who are chiropractors who have two separate practices. They must make a shitload of money. We were the only with them for dinner half the week, and when they were th here, they were usually talking shop. Wait, but I thought chiropractors only work till like 5.30 like anybody else. They're not like ER doctors who need to be gone like all night. I don't understand. I am Confucia. It was more an of an obligation to be there. Their physical presence meant they were making an effort, which actually meant they didn't have to help mediate between us. They had an idea about how much I despited my brothers, <laughs> but apparently they thought acting like everything was just right would make things right somehow. Newsflash. Nope. <laughs> Nothing would ever get better because my parents would never actually do anything for us. They never did, and it didn't seem like they were going to start caring anytime soon. It sucked, and there was nothing I could do about it but sucking up my thoughts and half-heartedly responding to their empty questions. Oh, that was cool. Bam, bam, bam. I like it. <laughs> I don't think that was on purpose. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> but just when I thought my day was torturous enough, it got worse. Oh, I'm sorry. Of course. Of course. Did. Of course. I had just started working on some homework on my laptop when the lights flicked off out of nowhere. Ghost! Ghost! Um, I had just started with, with, with all, all of them. Of In our whole two-story house. Brag explaining. <laughs> I and, and, and the garage, too. And the pool, the pool house. <laughs> with the extra guest house at the back. In the basement. I yeah. guess that's, that's not too And the, the peacock pen. <laughs> Greenhouse. So it's all, all the lights went off. Every single one. Even the butler's quarters. <laughs> I didn't even need to ponder on it for a second before the identity of the culprit came to mind. Yes, Eric! He, he hit all of the lights at once. Because he is om omnipotent. He, he just Un hit the breaker. <laughs> like there. <laughs> Eric! There was nobody else to blame. It was him. <laughs> it had to be him. Totally. Whenever something strange happened in our house... The one behind everything would always be that insufferable older, older brother of mine. I was certain that the blackout just had to be his doing. I had to pad out in my socks and cling to the wall like an animal to find out what was happening. I'm so gonna... I, I always walk around in my socks. I'm wearing socks right now. Yeah, who, who doesn't plot around in their socks Apparently now? Apparently not Americans, I don't know. Or whoever it is. I don't have... Mm. Eric and everyone else had congregated in the upstairs family room, so they had just been waiting on me. What? They really fucking fast. They were like, whoa! Eric <laughs> pointed to the, to the family room. <laughs> Emergency <laughs> to the family room now! <laughs> just have an alarm. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody in the, in the Jameson household knows the drill. Get to the family room and there is an emergency. <laughs> Follow the luminescent paint on the ground. Get to the emergency shelter. The yellow line takes you to the family room. The red line takes you outside. Yeah. The blue one takes you to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, uh, I'm not, uh, I don't want to be the mom. You can be the mom. I have to I'm, be honest. I'm Eric. What, are you going to be dad too? Sure. If he ever shows up. Jazz, sweetie. Daddy's calling the electrician. I couldn't help but sigh in frustration. What did Eric do? Try to plug in three back massages at once again? Again. <laughs> he's, he's enterprising. He's trying to do something. <laughs> Mom didn't even blink at my remark. She gave me a serious look. Her scolding looked to be precise. As if it would work on me. As if. I wasn't five anymore. I'm six. <laughs> six and a half. I returned her glare with an exasperated sigh. Jazz. Jazz. Your brother knows very well that they are tools of the trade and not toys. Dad sounded stern, and I gathered he must have rejoined us. Hope he's a big buff guy. Oh, great. That wasn't how it seemed last time. Jasmine. The disappointed frustration in my parents' faces did not escape my eyes. Ha! <laughs> Whatever. Whatever. 
What did he know? Eric knew no such thing. Dogs learned faster than he did. Harsh. I wondered if he, we could trade him in at the pound. All of a sudden, there was a loud chewing near my ear, <laughs> like a cow chewing its cud. It was one thing to hear something else like that in the light of day, but in pitch black, it definitely freaked me out. I shrieked and reached out to push the figure next to me away. It was my dad. Ah, you creep. Get away from me. He just started laughing really hard, as if it was the most hilarious thing when it clearly wasn't. Much to my utmost irritation. She needs to relax a little bit. Like, it's not a big deal. I picked sassy, not complete bitch. I couldn't take it any longer and stormed back to my bedroom. On the way there, hearing my parents address each other about me with concern, as if I was the problem in the family. No, no. Well, at this point, you seem like it. They weren't even going to pretend they cared about my predicament. Oh, I got it. Gina, are you going to deal with this or should I? Fuck off, Dad. It's all right. I'll go. Sweet. Now my mother was hot on my tail, huh? She's definitely hot. <laughs> <laughs> I heard her footsteps follow mine, but it had a head start. I had a head start of a minute. She could never close the distance. <laughs> how, how does she know exactly one minute? Ugh. I didn't want to talk or whatever. It was <laughs> she had in mind. Talk or whatever it was she had in mind. Yeah. I just knew she was going to make everything worse. See, now see, it, it fucks up when you add commas. Yeah. What's gone in Jasmine? It's either adolescence or you. Oh, God. But I bet it's the love. Phrasing. A moment later, my mother was already banging on the door to my room. After a deep breath, I answered the door. <gasps> Dad, listen to me. Your brother has a lot to deal with. Hey, the fucking stoner sitting in his room listening to death metal. His D&D &D character is about to die. <laughs> it's been a long campaign. <laughs> <laughs> you have to understand that. Like what? Sitting on the couch as soon as he got home, wasting his life away playing dumb video games. Stop describing me, you bitch. Listening to satanic screamos. Oh, that's a new way of putting screamos it. Screamos, not a genre. But screamos, <laughs> they're people. You know how it is with teens his age, don't you? He's older and. She was still talking. <laughs> with one else? Still. That one is good too. <laughs> <laughs> they, they fixed it. One still has. Should have put, a, should've put a, a. Not an apostrophe. Uh, an asterisk on that one. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, that was the correction. <laughs> she had to be kidding me. How the hell should I have known? And why should I care what he had to deal with? What about me <laughs> and my feelings? Okay, Mom. I'm going to stop you right there. Not like I actually paid attention to where she was getting at anymore. There was just this boiling rage welling up in me now, and I had to let it... You've already screamed at him all day. What more do you want? I had to let it out. What did I even do? Am I interpreting this wrong, or are you blatantly saying to my face that I'm the wrong one here? Are you even listening to yourself? You're always finding excuses for Eric to justify his stupid, stupid ways. And thanks to that, he's never responsible for anything. He'll never stop being as crappy as he is now, <laughs> thanks to you. Jazz, calm down now, won't you? No, Jazz is always frantic. You're being disrespectful, not only to your brother, but even me. I'm being disrespectful. How come I don't get to speak for myself? All you do is speak for yourself. Why do you and Dad know? Even Eric, why does everyone always disregard everything I say? Mom, <laughs> do my words have no value at all? Mom tried to restrain a sigh, but failed. <laughs> Fail! <laughs> she failed! <laughs> wow. I could see that she practically viewed me as my brother. As a bother. I don't know how I meant viewed me as a brother, too. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> why did they viewed me wrong? Viewed you as a brother. But yeah, bother next question. Yeah, viewed me as a bother. Yeah, We're Mom. Homies, Mom. I didn't want to have this conversation either. It's nothing like that. Oh, it exactly <laughs> was like that. We hear you, 
but you have to start seeing things in our perspective too. Only then we'll be able to live as how a normal family should. What? We're not normal? <laughs> I thought I, th this is news to me. Maybe we sh we would be a bit more like a normal family if you weren't gone all the time. But of course, <laughs> that's out of the question. I did not just actually said that. <laughs> Mom stared at me in a disbelief, as if I just struck a knife to her abdomen. Her mouth hung open. <laughs> <laughs> Abdom Oh wait, wait. A knife to her abandonment. <laughs> I even said abdomen on my own. <laughs> abandonment. I struck her abandonment with my knife. <laughs> well, maybe maybe I'm just I don't Wait, wait, wait. I think it's supposed to be abandonment. Well it's like it's like two phrases mixed together. A knife to the abdomen and her abandonment. But I'm not sure how they got together. I stuck her in the abandonment. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Take that abandonment. <laughs> as much as me and Eric hated the fact that our parents were never around, we tried to we tried to our best <laughs> to not let it show. We should we shouldn't be laughing at this. <laughs> well it's, it's spelling errors. I know, but they try so hard. We, we appreciate the concept, <sighs> but maybe check it Ooh. over again. You did. You if, do if, have a lot of words. If you're not a native English speaker, then it's fine. Yeah, we get it. My dad's not a native Ooh. English speaker. God. And he corrects our English. He's, he's actually he's actually a weird grammar oh snob. Oh my god! Oh fuck! Continue. Yeah. This was getting out of Ooh. hands. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Anyway. <laughs> I was getting so worked up. I felt myself losing self-control by the second. If you come in here just to tell me how a horrible a per of a person you think I am and how Eric is not, you failed. He's a joke. And that's that. Please just leave. I don't want to hear any more of this. This is getting out of hand. <laughs> she sighed again, sounding tired. She must have been tired to have a couple of children like us. I'd be tired too if I was given Eric Fail Jamison as my son. <laughs> Poor mom. <laughs> I could feel her gaze fell on me for some moment, but I didn't meet her eyes. When she reached the door, mom turned around and spoke in a soft voice. Mm. You know, <laughs> we have the letter box on our door for all your thoughts. You should try using it sometime. No. Okay. Oh, right. The letter box. I absolutely <laughs> forgot. <laughs> I have to admit, that was a decent parenting initiative there. The idea was that they were too busy to personally listen to us, so instead, we could put our problems on paper for them to get to when they had a free minute. <laughs> Good in theory, but if they read anything I'd ever written in there before, they hadn't shown it. It's like Michael on The Office with his suggestion box. <laughs> yeah. Five years later, <laughs> they'll like pull it open. It's like, all right. Did you do something about your coffee breath? Yeah. Or your B.O. Like when I wrote a note to put in the box that outlined how my history teacher said I had a promising future career as a teacher. Like you, no thanks. <laughs> and then mom said she had no idea that I, what I'd be good at at career day rolled around. Really? Thoughts that you don't even have the time to read. Yeah. Like to lead, not to read. <laughs> Thinking about it got me even more enraged. And you know what? I had every right to be angry. She is on a roll. <laughs> like this, this entire intro has just been her being Ang off the angry. <laughs> yeah, the light flicked back on just in time for me to give my mother a very point. How did we know all this was going on if the lights were off? Like did they're like gla glaring at each other and well, stuff. Well, there's still like the lights like outside. I guess, but I would assume. But she could have seen the pointed look anyway then. <laughs> I suppose I should have been relieved that the interruption to my night had been a relatively minor. But it had... <laughs> that was me, not that. Yeah. But it had opened up a whole new can of worms. Namely, how was I going to go on living in the presence of such an obnoxious freak? Especially with my parents singing praises about him and rationali rationalizing everything that he did. How can you praise him if he hasn't done anything? It's like, oh, you woke up, son. Yeah. He's so good at D&D. He, he got out of bed. Yeah. His character's level five. 
He smoked a huge bowl. <laughs> <laughs> go, Alan, son, go. Then my mom, having nothing to say at my last remark, came out with the final blow. You can't choose your family, but the least you can do is try and live with what you have. Enlightening, <laughs> mom. She didn't understand me. Like everyone else. She responded to my if looks could kill glare with a grimace and finally disappeared behind the door. She's a ghost. <laughs> yeah, she just goes right through. It's like, <gasps> <gasps> <laughs> It explains so much. They're not chiropractors. They just disappear. They literally disappear. <laughs> it's gone. They're literally not there for us. To tell the truth, I was half expecting her to realize what she had just said, return to my room, and apologize to me. Totally. So when the door actually opened minutes later, I looked up expecting the only to glare daggers at the head that popped up. Is Eric? Eric! I didn't oh count on God, it being my brother Eric. instead. Oh my God. My brother, the toenails jam sandwich eater, <laughs> was getting his grubby hands in my space of sanctity. Unacceptable. I grabbed a tissue from the tissue box on my bedside table and paced back over to the expanse of, m of the room to wipe off the doorknob. Really? Knock! This room has no disgusting pig policy. And don't, don't even touch my <laughs> doorknob or anywhere without wiping yourself down first. Oh, wow. I had always been a bit of a neat freak. No shame in that. Well, Eric, on the other hand, was a complete mess. How were we even related again? Well, your mom <laughs> had sex with your dad. The chewing in the ear thing was funny. Don't be so uptight. Take a joke, Jazz. It's good for you sometimes. God. I shooted him a glare. <laughs> 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 oh, okay. I'll take a joke. I so would if your stacks of dumb jokes were even remotely funny. You being dirty, on the other hand, <laughs> is no joke. Quit acting like a slob. I don't act that's au naturel. He sniffed his pits and then stretched out his arms to me. That's twice for today I, that I had witnessed. I was done. You upset? Now how about a makeup hug, little sis? He started advancing towards me, and I could almost smell his grossness emanating from that freaky band t-shirt that he probably hadn't had washed in three weeks. I screamed. No way was I going to let him. I pushed Eric out the door and slammed it on him. Did He didn't really protest. Once outside, he spoke with a door separating us. If you weren't such a daddy's girl, I would so... Daddy's girl? Oh, yeah. If only, Eric, if I were a daddy's girl, maybe dad would give a shit about how I feel. Maybe mom. I stopped myself mid-sentence. I really was getting carried away. Shaking my head, I went back to bed, burying my <laughs> head in my pillow. How do you go back to bed when you were doing homework? Shaking my head. Yeah, I did this one. Yeah. I had had enough of this for tonight. That was just my usual day with Eric Jameson, the world's worst older brother. <laughs> Kill me. Harsh. I think <clears throat> I think some people have it worst. Yeah. Older. Worst. <laughs> okay, we're going to end the episode here because it's getting long. The rant has gone on for an entire episode. Oh, God. Like, there is not... This is all inside her head, but when we picked Sassy, oh, God. Yeah, no, this is like sassy level This 99. is like venomous. <laughs> She's like bitching out the entire world. Like, she is just... They, all of a sudden, they were angry all the time. They were at school, then they were home again, then the lights were outside. Like the the the. the she's the, never happy with anything. Ever. The timeline of this, she's been like pissed off for two days straight so far. <laughs> like, that's quite significant. Anyways, I, I'll probably play one more episode. I'm not sure if I'll play anymore after that, but let us know. Yeah, if you want to, you know, if you want to, like, play, comment, yeah. subscribe. You know, yeah. let us know what you want to see more of. Tell us, tell us, tell us. Okay, goodbye. Good bye. <laughs>